What's going on, everybody? I'm pro singer David Braley. I am here with my housemate, Kate. Say hi, Kate. Hi, Kate. Excellent. Today <laughs> we're hitting up a little bit of Jung Cook. This is his time performing live in Times Square. Let's give it a go. start let's stop there see what do you think so so far if you don't know this Kate's knowledge of pop culture is um well what do you work reckon uh, a 70s folk rock and some so not rock. nothing pop nothing today which is fine uh, i mean some pop some pop okay what i know of of k-pop anything i know from k-pop i know from my niece Brittany. Okay. She just is manic for that, these guys. And that makes that makes sense. That's their that's their their base, right? Mm -hmm. Um so Jung Cook is a member of BTS. He's doing his solo album out on solo tour. In this performance, he does about four separate songs. And I know this song because I reviewed it previously, uh his music video. His music video was pretty um pretty awesome to be honest. Uh, it just I, it was very like young like disco-y, uh, um, uh, oh, young no, Michael Jackson. my jam. There you go. Sorry. Very Well, not, I don't want to say disco because, you know, all the kids listening will be like, oh, my God, that's, disco's so carny. He's so much cooler than that. Which, yes, he is. But, like, this is very, I say, like, Michael Jackson. Um, I see a lot of Michael Jackson in here. Yeah. Like, 19... Was it? Was that, was that uh, uh, album in 1970? He's on the piano. Not Thriller. Not 1970. Not 1970. Michael he Jackson. A he's an LP on yeah. the leaning on the piano. 80. Sorry. Yeah. Okay, on the 80s piano. makes more sense. What's, what's, uh, that's, that's the cover. I, I, that's what. That's what I hear in this. Especially okay. you got okay. the jazz flute in there. The. It's very um, that that very 70s over the top. Then the you got a sick bass line, which I love that sick bass line. But I know you voice, love the sick bass line. His uh, his voice then versus here has changed because obviously he's singing live versus a very yeah. well manicured studio voice, mm -hmm. right? And uh, he sings he's singing a lot more full voice, and I really like it. What are you what are you thinking so far? Well, I definitely hear a lot of the Michael Jackson, and that's I mean as pop as Michael Jackson was, mm -hmm. um, definitely see a lot of that and a lot of the dance moves. Um, oh, okay. Oh, it's it's good it's uh -huh. not something i would probably pop around the house singing right right that makes sense fair fair because he sings way higher than i can <laughs> so there's that me too yes all right let's keep it going and make sure everything's lined up here we go right Next to you, 
next to you You know it's deeper than the rain It's deeper than the pain But it's deep than DNA Something they can take away Hey! Standing next to you Oh, I'm gonna stop before it gets into the break dance. Or to the dance break. So. Okay. <laughs> the break dance, yes, because that's that's exactly what I can see Jungkook doing right now. It's just dropping and break dancing, spin windmills, windmills right now. Um, I kind of after that that breakdown that uh, that he just did, that was very Justin Timberlake to me. That felt very. Not a bone, kind of thing. Like he just kind of. I don't know that much about Justin Timberlake. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sorry to my nieces. Hey, um, that's okay. That's why you're here. But it felt very. Uh, what about? It's also um, very. It's very ad libby of Michael Jackson. He does a lot of that. Shampoo, shampoo, You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah. But I, I don't want to make. I'm not making fun of him. What he did sounds great, which made it feel yeah. like you know, if this song wasn't his, Justin Timberlake would have bought it in five seconds. You know what I mean? Okay. No. You can see that. Yeah. I like his... Because his latest, Justin Timberlake's latest, yes. Now I can see yeah. what, where you're going with. And he's a, just a well-rounded performer. Very, He's very engaging with the audience. He's singing fully live. Um, I could hear it. Um, he's got the he's got a track on for his for the chorus, but you can, okay. he's, that's when he's dancing. He's yeah. improving around the chorus, which, which is exactly what you want to do when you have that backing track. That backing track That's is... what I do all the yes. time. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so from a professional's point of view, like the, that backing track is genuinely only there to give you a bit of relief, say, come the chorus, and it's there to instill the melody line of your chorus, especially like those backing vocals. If your chorus is meant to be sung by a chorus, then have a backing vocal and sing around it. Sing with it, sing around it. Um, you could, it, it, it helps. It just, it's a well-rounded thing to do with, uh, with, without having live backing dancer, backing singers, you know? So he's, he's got, got him tracked as well as his own voice in there, which is perfectly fine. Um, it should be, it's his song. Uh, but yeah, I like it so far. Everything looks good. Um, very, like I said, well-rounded performer, I think. I don't have your ear. I can't tell any of that. So, okay. <laughs> I just... Sorry, I'm just. You see the drones flying around though. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. It is. That's annoying. Like, yeah. Like I, I'm gonna be like the cat and just swat at him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hey everybody, if you're enjoying the content and you would like to see the channel grow, why don't you join us over on Patreon? On Patreon, we're going to have exclusive episodes of reactions, music history, as well as live streaming and performance behind the scenes of my travels and everything there in between all wrapped up in one place. I hope to see you over there. Until then, let's get back to it. All right, let's, let's, uh... Sorry, that was bugging me. I just said that. That looks like mine. That's very Michael Jackson, that choreography. Mm -hmm. Stop and then. Yep. Mm -hmm. A little bit of bone thrown in, maybe. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Wow. Yeah, I'm a fan. I thought that was a lot of fun. It's a good it's tune. Like, uh, but like you said, the those bloody those, the those drones. Like, I don't know if they're if it's the like if it's TSX or if it's the the Times Square or if it's MTV's drones or what. But that is is this going to be like the new thing? We got to watch everything now. Everything's being double filmed by eighteen thousand drones all of a sudden. Because they cost like twenty bucks on TV, on TV, on it, on you know that that horrible uh, big, big website that isn't paying me enough to say anything about them. Anyway, okay. <laughs> um, well, that well, then. not better. No. Okay. <laughs> um, but this, uh, yeah, this this is. I was a fan. I like his uh, great dancer. He makes everything look really easy, even though he's 
years of training and practice. This is my first experience listening to BTS okay. or, or any any K-pop. And what do you, what Sorry. is your what is your feeling? It's it's actually better than I thought it would be. Fantastic. So yeah, awesome. I well, like I wasn't that. Quite sure, except I wasn't quite sure what to expect. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, there it all. It all comes from something that happened prior to it. it. There's familiarity in it, in the pop, in a lot of the rhythms, especially this. I mean, he really, I feel like he went into what the type of music he really leaned into, really enjoyed. He likes the Motown stuff. He liked the early Mike, Michael Jackson stuff. He likes the Earth, Wind, Fire, yeah. uh, the Tower I, of Power. I am a fan of yeah. If we do that, I'm, oh yeah, I got all sorts of. You, you could hear it in the track. It, it didn't pop out as much as the live as the CD does, okay. but it has a lot of these fills, these horn fills, and that's very reminiscent of like a of of uh, little fill, little horn fills in um, Tower of Power, Earth, Wind, and Fire, all of those groups. Mm -hmm. um, and he, you could tell like those the thought went band. into this, which was nice. Uh, old what? Some of the funk bands that 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 I think of as funk, they they've got all of that. Absolutely, absolutely. And this ba that bass line is, you know, that's that's a funky bass line. I'll learn how to play it, guys. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed it. I know oh, I did. You. From me and my housemate, Kate. Say bye, Kate. Bye, Kate. <laughs> <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs> Cheers. Bye. Catch you on the flippity flop. Bye. <laughs>